Assalamu alaikum. In this video, I'm going to show you that how can you write any language right inside your Microsoft Word document with so much ease. Now, this has become really very easy. Uh, when you have to write something, uh, like you are making a Word document in English, you have to give you examples of French, ki, German, ki, Urdu, ki, Hindi. Ki. Normally, there is one thing regional settings. You have to install computer in your language or do it. That is how things have been. Region, region and language. This is normally English is selected. You have a computer in Windows, just like UEV. There is an option for language packs. Do you have a language pack to install it? And you have a dusri language likhne ki capabilities aa jati hain fir aap keyboard mein karke to you can do that ye to hai ek uh, process jo ke har computer pe available aam taur pe nahi hota aur not everyone is very easy with that ab google ne ek bahut zabardast option di hai that i'm going to show you and you'll be amazed ke how easy things have become so uh, this is to write here google input tools so it shows you this and you click this first link and here you go Achha, what is this? This is uh, an amazing thing. Google is going to install that language uh, language pack inside your computer, whichever computer is this, and even it can be on the mobile devices or even tablets or uh, whichever i whichever operating system that has iOS, Android, or anything. Even Mac, Windows, everything goes fine with this. It is based on uh, something known as transliterate. What is transliterate? Now, what is a transliteration? Transliteration is that when you uh, when you write your language through another language, that is not that you translate it. For example, I'm showing, going to show you. Most of us chat on internet and we write such stuff. For example, up Skype or yeah, you are on any, any any other chat place, you write. Kya hal hai? This is known as transliteration or iski translation jo hoti hai, wo hoti hai ke how are you? Sahi? So Urdu ka jo sentence hai ke aap kaise hai ki translation hoti hai how are you? But uski transliteration jo hoti hai wo ye hoti hai ke aap ek dusri language use karte hai apni language likhne ke liye. So I hope most of us do that so many times. Hum log messages pe or this happens across languages. People in mobile phones mein wo language नहीं इंस्टॉल होती है आपने फारसी में लिखना है और फारसी आपके मोबाइल में इंस्टॉल नहीं है जो कि अक्सर फोन के साथ इशू होता है सो so, आप ट्रांसलिटरेशन यूज करते हैं और अपनी जुबान वाली बात उस जुबान में उसके स्पेलिंग्स में यूज कर करके आप लिख देते हैं सो गूगल इनपुट इज एक्चुअली बेस्ड ऑन ट्रांसलिटरेशन अच्छा how are we going to do this? It's very easy. Try it out. Click here. It's going to ask you where are you going to install that. आप कहते हैं I want to download this for my Windows. That's for my computer. Now here are the options of the languages you have. We have Urdu. We have oh my God, Bengali, Greek, Hebrew, Marathi, Russian, Siberian, uh, Serbian, Tamil, Arabic, Persian, Gujarati, Hindi. My goodness, Punjabi. Click this one, and you agree. Yeah, you agree to Google. If they're giving this to you for free, you have to agree. Download. It downloads. It's a very tiny one in KBs, less than an MB. Wow. You click this. It asks you, run. Yes, you run. And then it's going to download the actual uh, application. It is downloading, as you can see. Uh, give it some time. It does it in less than a minute. Done. We are done. Click. Now, what are we going to do? Since we installed that on this computer, uh, we are going to open Microsoft Word document. Kya hal hai is Urdu. How are you is English. I, by the way, have installed Urdu already in the computer. So when I, I click on this English button here, now I see three of them. Punjabi of India, Urdu. This is uh, for Pakistan in English. That is by default. Now let's try our hands on Punjabi for Hor ki hal hai. Now the issue is that this Punjabi that we are writing over here is actually um, Indian Punjabi. So th this is an Indian script that you see. Now let's uh, uh, try Urdu. If I say kya, now the spelling of kya is K-I-A. Sahi? C, the options that you, you may have to keep your eyes over here. It is not seamless typing ke aap type kiye ja rahe hain aur words dali ja raha it is not really that lekin agar aapko kuch words aise hain jinke aap jo unke english spellings hain wo agar aap theek nahi likhenge to wo aapko yahan option samne hogi to you can consult that ye kya pe click kar dijiye kya aa gaya and then you say hal h a a l and i click enter 
फर्स्ट ऑप्शन एंटर पे खुद इंसर्ट हो जाती है है एच ए वाई क्या हाल है ओ सॉरी आई फॉर गॉट टू गिव अ स्पेस ठीक सो लेट्स ट्राई दैट समवेयर इन द मिडल यहाँ लिखा हुआ है दीज वराइटीज विच इंक्लूड ओके फर्दर एक्सप्लेन दी सॉरी 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 नाउ दैट आई एम गोइंग टू राइट इन इंग्लिश फॉर सम टाइम बस थोड़ा सा आपको एहतियात इस चीज़ की करनी है दैट यू हैव टू स्विच वेरी केयरफुली ताकि ये ना हो कि आप लिखना शुरू करें और वहाँ उर्दू चल रही हो या हिंदी चल रही हो यू जस्ट राइट आप इंग्लिश पे स्विच कर गए दी एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ दिस इन उर्दू आर अब हमने एग्जाम्पल्स लिखनी है सो विल क्लिक हेयर चूज उर्दू के ली सॉरी इट अगेन इज इन इंग्लिश आई हैव टू चूज उर्दू के लिए सी मैंने कितना बड़ा वर्ड लिखा के लिए वी आर गिविंग एग्जाम्पल्स ऑफ उर्दू इन्फ्लेक्शन सो के लिए या फिर क्यों के गॉड लुक एट दैट सो सो वेन यू राइट दीज थिंग्स यू सेव दैम यू क्लोज द डॉक्यूमेंट यू री ओपन इट दे आर नॉट गॉन आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू दे आर नॉट गॉन दिस वॉज द डॉक्यूमेंट वी हैव इन This is not gone. When you will print it, it's going to print the same. So this is a wonderful tool. You can actually try uh, the languages which were here. You can try all of them. They work wonderfully. Anyway, um, that's it for now. And uh, I like you can see you can easily insert Urdu characters or Urdu words inside your English text if you like to give examples. And there are a bunch of other languages also available on Google input tools. type anywhere in your language and you can since you have installed that on this computer that means if you even if you open skype even if you open powerpoint even if you do anything even if you want to write something in urdu over here you can do that so it is good that there are some websites which ask you to write in that particular language you can do that easily and uh, i like i told you transliteration we are very used to it already so i hope this should not pose you any problems in understanding the spellings and the produced words i hope this helps you and uh, do let me know if you have any questions see you in the other video and with some more things about the text documents thank you very much for watching allah hafiz